Hi everyone and welcome back to Let's Be The Sims 4 Horse Ranch Rags to Riches. This is episode 3, oh my gosh. Since the last episode I've kind of just taken care of Tara's needs and I planted everything that we found during our cave adventure at the end of last episode. Um, currently we're cleaning the horse bed because it was very dirty but yeah I planted the cherry trees and the rose. We also got the perfect grape that I put here and then we had the plantains so I planted those as well. I'm hoping these will grow fast because I really want to make some nectar but I don't really want to buy the ingredients. I also sheared a little porridge. I think she's ready. Is it a she? I don't think they have a gender, you know? Um, wait, how come you get 45 simoleons now? Previously, you would only get 30. Does it like change depending how good friends you are? Because I did spend some time socializing with Porridge last night and our bar has gone up quite a bit. And I feel like we have quite a few interactions from being an animal lover. Like I've never seen show dance move or smother Porridge with love before. Let's also put this in our inventory. I breeded the frogs. Are they ready? They are ready to be bred again. So I'm gonna sell two of the frogs to make some money. Hold on, so if I already have a perfect quality plant, I don't need to put like really good fertilizer on it, right? Because that would just make the quality better. At least that's what it means in my head. Oh, I, we can't fertilize yet either. We don't have enough gardening skill. But I think I will sell this as well because I feel like we're going to get a bunch of these. This is third place. It's going to give us a hundred. So we have quite a lot of money. I have read your comments as well. And a lot of you guys said we should make the lot a tiny house, a tiny whatever, a tiny lot. So we can do a tiny home residential. I have placed 49. Okay. I mean, it's just these, right? What's the difference between a tiny and a micro home? It doesn't really tell you when you hover over it. Oh, here we go. Oh, plants grow twice as fast as normal. Oh my God, we definitely need to do this. Lower bills, although I think our bills are already quite low. Skills increase at double the standard rate. Okay, do we not get the same ones? Okay, we don't. Okay, so we want it to be a micro home. So definitely gonna make this smaller. Oh gosh, there we go. Okay, it's a little bit too big still. So if we bring that in, there we go. We have a micro home. That feels a little bit cheating considering we have a massive lot and we could place this stuff like anywhere, but we're definitely gonna do it. So thank you for the tip. So we're kind of hungry. Also, we have an uncomfortable buff because we've been eating unbalanced meals. Too much ramen and chips, basically. I was thinking we should adopt another horse yeah. and then train it and then sell it and maybe even breed them if I adopt a stallion. Oh no, why did you just give us a broken heart? Do you want a little brushing? Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, we need to actually take porridge with us. <gasps> Oh my gosh, we can ask for gardening help? Okay, wait, let's do that. But I need to take Porridge with us to the cave so that we can enter the next stage. Let's see if they'll agree. Yes, Porridge will try to help Tara by eating any weeds that appear. That's so cute. Oh, there we go. We can put Porridge in our inventory. <laughs> That's so random. Wow, Firefly is doing really, really well. So we can go for a ride. Oh, we definitely should do another competition today. Why not? So it makes us more money. Wait, hold on. Maybe I'll buy the mini fridge. Can you only get like the quick meals from here though? Because we kind of need actual food. But we'll get it. It's not crazy expensive. Because our hunger is down. Have a quick meal. Oh, you can cook from here. Although there's nowhere to cook anything. Okay, we'll just have a quick meal. What on earth is canned water? That sounds gross for some reason. Let's have a peanut butter and jelly sandwich for breakfast and then we'll go for a ride and a competition and look into adopting another horse. Okay, great. Let's actually go over here and do some more 
practice on the barrels and then we can do either a barrel competition or another western pleasure we did unlock the intermediate stage oh my god yeah this was the only thing i saw but yeah we do also have the obstacles here i don't know if we should focus on like one thing at a time or do all of them how long do horses live do i have time to master everything with aging on it is a long lifespan and i'm assuming that also affects animals but look we're really close <gasps> I wonder if horses will also get double um, skill gain from the tiny house or only sims because our riding is going up. We're about to be level four. There we go. We can now discuss horse riding with other sims and we are less likely to get bucked off of horses while riding. I feel like it says that every single time you level up. This is very relaxing though and it's a nice sunny but windy day. You can kind of hear the wind. I don't know if you can hear it in the recording but it's nice and peaceful. I think we'll travel to the uh, equestrian center now. We should also make some friends and we're traveling, but I can see now that we have really good compatibility with Don and Juniper, who I spent a little bit of time talking to last night when I went to the bar to get some chips. And then Almond, whoever she is, we should also make friends with her. But we'll focus on that some other time. Okay, here we are. Let's um, do a competition. Does it cost a lot more to do the intermediate one? It's 250. I think we'd be safer off doing either the beginner one again and then hoping that we will place better. Or I think we could also do the barrel racing one. I think this one could be fun. We're close to all the requirements. So let's do uh, the barrel racing competition and hopefully gain some money. Wait, I never heard this audio before. Ooh, I wish I could see. All right, let's see how we did. <gasps> Silver? Okay, so we earned 250. That's nice. Well done, your hardworking duo made it to second place. You had a few minor inefficiencies rounding the barrels, but with a little more practice, you can take the top spot. <gasps> Amazing. Okay, great. You can only do one competition per day per horse. So if I had a lot of horses, I could actually take each horse into a competition once a day, but every horse can only do it once. Oh yeah, Sienna is here as well. I wonder how much the horse training costs. Oh, that's not a lot. We have almost 700 simoleons. Takes 80 minutes. Yeah, we could do one actually. Just for fun, testing it out. I don't want to do the jumping because we haven't even tried it yet. But we could definitely do uh, agility or endurance. I mean, we'll do agility. It means we don't have to run around the barrels for as long. Trying to learn it that way. Oh my gosh. All right. Will you train my horse? Oh my god. Where is she going? <laughs> she's just going in there. Oh, she's off for training. Can we just do whatever while... Fireflies in there. Rescue a horse. Yeah, I wanted to see what other horses were up for rescue. Wow, okay, so I can tell this one's an elder and this one looks like an elder as well. I don't want to do an elder <laughs> just because I feel like I won't have as much time to train them. And I am not ready for a horse death. Then we have the two full. So it looks like we're gonna have to go with either persim persimon, persimmon, how do you say that? Or endeavor. This one looks absolutely stunning. It's a Colorado Ranger and this one is a, how do you say that? Track, trackener? Tra trackener? <laughs> oh my god. This one is needy, intelligent, and defiant. It's a stallion, so we could make babies. What about you? So you are a mare. I feel like the fact that I can't say this name means I shouldn't get this horse unless I rename it because that's a possibility. I think we'll go with Endeavor. I don't know if it's a good idea to get a lot of horses, but I want to do it. And I think I'm only going to get emotionally attached to Firefly and then try and be able to sell the other ones. So let's um, purchase Endeavor. It's a cool name, but not my favorite what would we change it to firefly like if we wanted to keep it to a theme i don't know what else 
is like Firefly. What category is that in? It's just giving me either like books or like camping vibes. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna go with Endeavor for now. If you guys have good ideas what to change the name to, comment down below and I might do it in the next episode. But yeah, 250 and we should have a new horse. We do. Endeavor. We're in here. Okay. Oh, wow. I thought it was fully black. Okay, we can't even afford what Bess is asking for. So let's ignore that. But yeah, we've got our new horse. Oh, so, so pretty. Look at the flower and everything. Well, let's um talk to Endeavor here. Maybe rub his neck. Oh, wow. So cool. Oh. And already acquired the temperament skill. So I thought we could level up at least some of the skills and maybe go to competition since I can take both of them and then sell him and make some money that way. And we could keep doing that maybe. Oh, why are you sad? Do you want a little brushing? I feel like they always enjoy that. There we go. Like, look, our friendship is already halfway and we just adopted this horse. What does that mean? How? Yay, Firefly is back as well and they've increased their skill. I don't think, did they reach next level? Is Firefly? Oh, how do you see it? What did we go for? Didn't we go in for agility? That did not give us much. Oh, you can see the awards here as well. Okay, cool. Value is already 825. And we've only owned her for a couple of days. So that's like a way to make money, I think. If we keep rescuing horses. Let me actually come over here and then I'll call the horses over here as well. And then I can direct one horse to practice on their own. And then I can ride the other horse. Or I mean, I could direct both of them. But I feel like we should try the jumping now because we still haven't done it. Okay, let's call over the horses. <gasps> Look at them coming. Okay, very cute. I feel like we should definitely have them breed. I feel like they would make such a cute little foal. So, how should we do this? Let's direct practice barrel. So let's have Endeavor do that on its own. And then we will mount Firefly and try the jumping. I think that should work. I don't think we need to stand there the whole time yep endeavor already got the agility skill <gasps> look at him go i'm gonna change the outfits because i want him to have matching tack and it's definitely gonna be mismatched okay here's our first time trying a jumpy oh, oh okay not a great start it's okay our horse is defiant i think let's try that again yay Good job. Okay, so we're training two horses. Yay! Okay, I love the jumping. Let's see one up close. Hopefully, this will be a good one. Yay! Okay, good. Oh my god, I just spotted that someone's making food. We need to get some of this because I need to get rid of this um, uncomfortable moodlet. Oh, which means we need to eat some actual food. Did you only make one portion? Oh my god. Please tell me that's not just one portion. No. Okay. Grilled plantains. Okay. We'll definitely eat that. Looks like Endeavor is done for whatever reason. Oh, he's sad. Oh, no. Oh, the barrel knocked over. I've never seen that before. I didn't know that could happen. Okay. Okay. I wish I saw that. I was not paying attention. Okay. Good job, Firefly. You're doing great. Oh. <laughs> Okay, I jinxed it. Ready. Let's have one good jump before we end this for now. Okay, yay! Okay, good job, good job. <gasps> Look, oh no, don't be sad. Okay, I feel horrible. Let's go cheer up Endeavor. Oh, and let's breed the frogs. I keep forgetting. It's such a good way to make money. There we go. Are you gonna feel any better? Yep, not sad anymore. Okay, good. Let's do a rub neck and then let's go get some food. Is that almond? What on earth? Oh my god. I forgot the horses can just come in. 
Oh, your fun is poor and your hunger is low. There's a bowl right there you could go play with. Let's um, ask her to play, why not? There's so many kids here just doing their homework. They've even left it on the ground. I feel like this is dangerous with the horses are running around. Here's another one. Here's another kid coming. What is this? There's even... How many kids are here? Like six? What on earth? Okay, well, at least we've got our food. We're gonna get rid of this and we'd let thanks to uh, Almond. It was Almond who made this. We're not really eating it, but hopefully we will soon. Well, there's not really many adults here who we could, you know, talk to. I think I'm gonna leave these kids be. Okay, now we have like a bunch of teenagers here too. Yeah, this is like the study spot of Chestnut Ridge, apparently. Yeah, she really won't eat her food. I don't know why not. Like, she just keeps holding it. Hello, you're hungry? Can you, can you eat this food, please? Where are you going? You can pet the horse while you're holding the food, but you won't eat the food. Seriously, please eat some. Can you just eat it? Honestly. I have some mods in. I should probably take them out in case this is a mod issue. <laughs> that is not a mod issue. But yeah, she won't eat the food. I guess we're gonna go home and eat something from there. Can we at least use the bathroom while we're here? What are the horses doing? Are they just waiting for us to go home? <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, I send Endeavor home. I don't know what's going on with the food. <laughs> we're gonna go to the caves real quick because I did pick up porridge, so we should be able to get to the next level. Also, I just want to get some money or whatever loot we can from there. Maybe I won't show you every single thing that pops up, but I'll show you our loot. You know, what we get. Oh yeah, here it is. Honestly, what is your name? Why can I never see it? Let's do a friendly introduction. I swear your name is Duke. How are you doing? Hunger is poor. We can definitely hand feed you some prairie grass. Oh, here we go. Yeah, Duke. I knew it. So this horse is Duke and the stable is called Duke's Hall. Coincidence? Question mark. I feel like there are no such things. Are you going to sleep right there? That's cute. Don is cooking. Let's go talk to him for a bit. See if we can maybe eat this food. He made mushroom steak, sounds kind of good. Okay, girl, do you have something against eating? Or can you just take a bite, please? Oh my God, oh, she's eating. Okay, it was that food or that lot or something. We have gotten rid of the curse. Oh, there's food here for you as well. Perfect, you can eat the prairie grass. All right, we'll do the quick cave trip. Oh my God, the mist over here. Kind of spooky actually going in this cave. <gasps> and there's fireflies. Okay, I take it back. Oh my god, our horse is firefly. And there's fireflies here. They're her friends. All right, let's get in the caves. Oh, we just got thrown off. Okay, so now that we have porridge with us, let's try and open this door. Oh my gosh, Tara brings the mini sheep to the door and urges it forward. The mini sheep makes a resounding buh sound and the door suddenly starts to open, revealing a new underground level to the cave. So we're now at level two. Perfect. Okay, we just got money from defeating a bear. Cool. This is something that comes up too. You can find some ore. I've never had this go wrong, so let's see. Yeah, we successfully extracted the ore, we got some hilariously tiny T-Rex arms, which we will be selling, of course. Oh no, okay, so for this T-Rex, you need red meat. How the heck am I gonna get that? No idea. We're done, we're going home. Oh my, oh, oh, no, we're not. We're passing out, oops. Okay, my bad. Okay, now we're going home. Wait, 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 we need to get more of these beds since we have two horses and these are only 50. So yeah, I'm getting another one. Also, <laughs> porridge is still in our inventory. Apparently getting unhappy, but we really need to sleep. Our sleeping hours are horrible. It's morning and we just went to bed. <gasps> Night on the town, free food and drinks. Okay. Yeah, we'll definitely visit a venue today. Okay, there's no way we're sleeping past 10. So let's make sure we place porridge in the world. 
We can also breed the frogs again. How are you doing? <gasps> Hunger, starving, oh my God. Can we call? Yeah, call goats and sheep to eat. Do not die, please. Okay, we'll take care of our needs. We'll sell the frogs and the trophy. And then do our plants need watering? Are they doing good? Right now when we shear um, porridge, we only get 22 simoleons. I really don't understand how that works. Is it like if you leave it for longer? I don't think I'm gonna figure it out. But uh, let's smother porridge with love because I feel really, really bad about leaving her in my inventory. And then you can also do tricks. Um, ask to roll over. So I do want to see that because we need to be good friends to be able to do that. Oh, okay, perfect sheep trick. Okay, so I did want to look at Endeavor in Cass. He is very, very pretty. So this is the everyday outfit. And then, yep, we have completely mismatched tack. Maybe for him, we can do a Western saddle. This one has like the pouches and stuff in the back. Very cool. We can do this one. Should we do like all black? Very cool. You know, I kind of love this actually. So we'll do the matching bridle. Would that be that one, I think? And we'll obviously do a blanket as well. Let's do that one. I like it when they're not really wearing anything in their everyday wear. I'm not really a fan of all the accessories, even for like cats and dogs. I never really used them. So we're good with this. How are you ready for shearing again? I feel like it's been five minutes. But yeah, I think I'm gonna stay here and train our horses until we get hungry and then we'll go and get free food from somewhere. So I'm gonna go all the way over here and make sure they're both practicing something. Maybe we could try and mount Endeavor for the first time. Perfect, they're both coming. Let's um, direct Firefly to do the jumping. Oh, Endeavor is happy that all his needs are met. So uh, yeah, let's try mounting. Are we gonna do uh, walking in circles again? Oh, we're going to the other side. I think we're good. Here's our new tack, okay. It's all good, it's all good, right? Okay, great. Let's do a little hug, adorable. And then, yeah, I think we'll do the barrels. And now both our horses are training, right? Yeah. Okay, very cool. Hey Tara, you're so notorious that one of my unscrupulous, how do you say that? Friends has been asking to meet you. Can I give them your number? I don't actually know what this is. I don't play that much Sims. I do a lot of cast and stuff. <laughs> what pack is this from? What is this? I'm gonna accept it. I'm a little bit nervous. Oh no, Firefly knocked over the beam. Okay, we can go and fix that hopefully without dismounting. No, we can't, but we'll dismount, it's fine. Okay, we're gonna continue. It's very cool to have two horses. I'm kind of into it. And I wanna breed them too. Maybe we'll do that before the end of the episode. And then maybe next time Firefly will give birth. That's crazy. Anyways, we reach horse riding a level five. We will no longer become tense from being too high up on the horse when riding. We can intensely train, which will increase a horse's skill more quickly. Okay, cool. Endeavor reach agility two, Firefly reach jumping two. Very good, very productive. This is good. Oh my God, little porridge. Careful, don't get in the way. I love the little jumps that they do. You came all the way over here just to see us. Wait, we should compete today and it's already four. And if I wanna do both horses, I think we should definitely go there right now. Okay, let's do a competition with Endeavor. I think we'll do this one. So we'll get in there. Oh, oh my God. Well, we needed to get off the horse anyway. <laughs> Not great though, but yeah, let's go in. And then hopefully we'll have time to do one with a Firefly. Okay, we're about done. Hopefully, okay, good. 
we placed we got a bronze medal i also wanted to breed the frogs so you couldn't do it while you were in there and then let's do a competition with firefly maybe we'll do the show jumping one yeah i think this one should go okay okay what is this now hey tara i've heard a lot about you mostly bad things but that's okay people don't usually like me either we should hang out sometime Joaquin, what on earth? Okay, that's so weird. Oh my god, gold? I was not expecting that. Well done, despite being newbies to the show jumping scene, you outclass the competition and are given the beginner division's first place prize. Okay, we just made so much money from that. And here we are. I am gonna sell the, yep, these things. Or should we keep it first place? No, I don't think we're gonna, we don't have anywhere else to put it. We don't even have walls. Let's sell this, we'll make even more money. I mean, how much money do we need to build a tiny house? Probably like closer to 10K. So we're not there just yet. We'll sell a frog too. We'll go get food now. I want our free food. Let's go to the oak barrel. I feel like with the dance floor, <laughs> there's just too much going on at the rusty horseshoe. It's not our scene right now. Obviously, we could go to a different world. You can ride your horses in all the worlds. I haven't placed any extra lots. If I had placed a restaurant, I would go to a restaurant. But it's fine for today. We'll come here. Do you have free food for us? Oh my god, zero simoleons. Okay, what's our favorite thing? Something filling. French fries? No, fish and chips maybe. Yeah, let's do fish and chips. That sounds filling enough and it's free. Maybe we'll even get a drink. I wonder if they sell nectar. Yay, okay, good. Anybody here that we know? Summer, what the heck are you wearing? Yeah, let me order a drink. Everything is free. Strawberry nectar, oh my God, there is nectar. Yes, let's get that. <gasps> Look at it, oh, that looks good. I'm jealous. I can't wait to make some nectar, but it's taking a while for any of our plants to grow. But we do have tiny home now, so they should grow faster. Umber is here. Okay, hi, let's discuss horse riding. Maybe brighten his day. I don't know what Umber's pronouns are. I'm assuming he, him. I've just never heard of the name Umber. Let's finish our drink. There we go. And we'll go home. I feel like we should have an even bigger garden. I want to expand it. So I'm going to buy a couple more seed packets. We'll plant those and then we'll breed our horses. And then I think that'll be it for this episode. Let's see what we get. Okay, how do you get strawberries? Maybe they're not like a starter plant. You know, where is porridge? Oh my God. I thought she might have run away. She's just over here. She's good. All right, we're gonna go off to bed, but first we're going to encourage our horses to breed. How do you do that again? Horse skills, what's in here? Talk about going fast, temperament. Okay, there's a bunch of stuff in there we haven't done, but let's encourage to breed with Endeavor and see if they'll do it. Okay, question mark. Oh, a thumbs up. Okay, great. Um, you go to bed and I'm gonna see if the horses make a little baby. Did they? Let them open profile. I cannot tell. The value has gone up a lot. All right, I'm just gonna do a couple of things to take care of our animals. And then I wanna check if Firefly is pregnant. <gasps> a couple of things are growing. Look at our perfect cherry tree. Also going to sell another frog. I really need to buy a trash can. There's nowhere to put these plates because I don't have a sink either, but I don't think I really need a sink. So I'd rather get a trash can. What's the cheapest one? This one's ugly. So I'm going to get this one. Let's put it closer to our lot so it's not so annoying running over to it every single time. Can we encourage to breed again? I think we can. So I don't think she got pregnant before, but let's try that again. We are getting a thumbs up every time we suggest it. So, oh, 
That's cute. There's a heart and everything. Amazing. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to wait till the next episode to find out if she's pregnant, if we're gonna have a little full join our family in episode four. But give this one a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe so you don't miss out on the next ones. If you have any suggestions or tips or name ideas for Endeavor, leave those in the comments. I'll definitely be reading those. But thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one and bye.